Hi. In this video we will show you the steps to install the Docker service on Windows Server Core Edition. We have already installed the Windows Server Core Data Center Edition for this demo. Login into the server through Hyper-V console using administrator credentials. We have already enabled the remote desktop for this VM. Please check the video description box for more information. You can check the current RDP settings through inbuilt script file. We can able to access this server core machine through RDP now. Find the server IP using IP config command. Access the server through RDP. First, install the Windows update using the sconfig command. It will display a list of server configuration option. Type number 6 and press enter. From the pop-up window, type a to install all the updates then press enter. It will show the list of updates that need to be installed in the VM. We have already installed all the updates on this VM for this demo. Make sure the VM is up to date. Press Enter to return to the main window and type 15 to exit this configuration page. Change to PowerShell prompt and make sure that the PowerShell window is running as administrator. Install the Nugent PowerShell module for Docker. Type Y and press Enter to install the Nugent provider. It will take few minutes to complete the installation process. Installation completed successfully. Install the Docker service using install package command. Type a and press enter to trust the Docker package. It will install the Windows container feature along with Docker service in the server. We need to reboot the server to complete the installation process. Reboot the server using shutdown command. server has been rebooted. Server is back to online. Use the get service command to verify the docker service status. And use start service command to start the docker service. The default location of docker.exe is C drive program files docker folder. Use the docker version command to verify its version. Thanks for watching this video.